Hey guys, this is the first tutorial out of five on how to play Horseshoes by Must Die. It's um, my latest project. If you haven't seen the original video, you can see it here. Just click on this. And yeah, it's um, got a cool light show and everything, so just click that if you haven't seen it so you know what you'll be learning. And um, as always, the project file download is in the description. And um, I wanted to ask you guys um, if you could please let me know in the comments below if I'm going too fast or too slow, if I'm not covering anything, just any kind of uh, feedback or request would be great, just because I'm not sure what level you guys are at. So anyways, um, as I said, I'll be doing five parts to this. Uh, this is the intro, then you've got the build up here, then you've got the drop here, then you've got the breakdown here and the outro here. So just click any of these annotations here um, uh, to see that part. And um, yeah, so um, I've turned actually the, the light show off just so you guys can see um, clearly which buttons I'll be pressing. And um, yeah, this I'll play the original first so you guys know which part is, um, you'll be learning now. So here it is. Okay, and um, yeah, so basically you start off like this. This is the finger position. So you kind of want to imagine a kind of triangle here. And you've got your thumb on the kick, snare with your middle finger, and then these two vocal samples here. So these, these pads. And um, basically how you want to play it is these three. You keep on playing these three, and then on the fourth time you play that, you're going to play these two together. So it goes like this. One, two, three, four. You play this twice, so one, two, three, four. That's the second time, and now you add in the guitar, so it's... Okay, and the guitars are here. You can see the finger positioning is very simple. You've got these five guitars. Um, first four fingers cover the first four guitars, and you just change the fourth and fifth guitar with your little finger. And you play them like this. First, second, third, fourth, back to the first, and then fifth. And then you start over again. So it's pretty simple. You put Basically, play the first four in order. First again, and then last. Okay? And um, just a quick tip on how to stay synchronized with this. You play the first guitar with the kick. Second with the snare. Third with the kick. Fourth with the kick. First with the kick again. Last one with these two. And back to the full first. Okay, so it's slower. Okay, so remember, first with the kick, second with the snare, third and fourth with the kick, and this one goes with these two. Okay? So basically you play this first part twice, so add the guitars in and you play this part once. Okay, and now what you do is you move, you start playing the kick and the snap, and you move down with your thumb here. And you've got this kind of percussion loop, 
sample thingy, whatever you want to call it, and you just keep this down for the rest of the for the rest of the intro, and uh, it sounds like this. Okay, so that's how you play it, and um, just to show you guys quickly, um, kind of, it's the exact same melody, but without, like, the same exact uh, rhythm for all of the pads, just without playing these two. But I'll just play it, slow it down without, just keep in mind you're keeping this down with your thumb, I'll slow it down just playing these two and the guitars, so it's... Then the second time you play the exact same thing with a small change. Then here. So the first time you play. Second time you play. Okay, that's the only difference. So I'll play that one more time. Original speed. Okay, and uh, yeah, that's basically it. Just keep in mind, at the end of this, you want to already have a, um, the right finger positioning to, to start this part. Okay, so um, basically what you want to do is from here, this position here, you move down with your thumb again, so from here, you move down here, and with these three, you move down to these. Okay, so from here, so it's this. Okay, so that's kind of the the transition to the build up. And um, here, you basically play. Okay, and here, what you want to do is when you're about to play this one, you already position yourself like this with these two. So when you're playing this the last time, you want to have your middle finger on the first guitar and this this index finger on this pad, so it's... Okay, and yeah, this is the build up, so just um, click here if you want to see that part, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed.